Favorite time of day. Also type of day. Ship cutting day. <sighs> Back to the habitation module. A few more corrupted pieces of data here. I'm gonna repair my cutter as well real quick. Hold on. But uh, are there any of the upgrades here that I want to get right now? I could buy my scanner. That's a good idea. Let's do that. I own my scanner now. Yay. How wonderful. We only got one more upgrade for that, too. Cool. Okay. Let's get a new ship. The B. Oh, I love that name, dude. I have to do the B. I have to. I absolutely have to, regardless of anything else. Be yourselves in chat, please. Yep. Does it have knees? We'll find out. No sensor towers on this one. But they've got a bunch of these... Um... Hold on a second. I promise I won't do this a bunch of times like I did yesterday, but I just have to do one thing to adjust for comfort here. Just so I'm properly cutting today. There we go. That ought to do it. The Hudson. I can't believe it. Yeah. Yeah. All right, well. I don't actually think there's any sort of issue with uh, hitting these cut points right away. Holy shit, does that really take that long? I knew it took a while, but is it really that long? My God. It's an investment, man. All right. But that's off. And in we go. It's a long time, man. Yeah, okay, so... You could probably even just destroy this panel, too, but of course that's not going to be the safe way to do it. Let's just go ahead and get inside and try to depressurize. But where's our airlock? Where's the airlock on the B? There it is. Way over here. A couple of them in the back. Airlock pressure levels dropping. So I've been thinking about it. I kind of want to try to take apart a ship. I've got an unpressurized uh, lobby here, by the way. I kind of want to try to take apart a ship from the front to the back. Airlock pressure level I dropping. think that'll be an effective way for me to uh, make salvaging the giant chunks in the back of the ship a little bit easier. Since we've been running into so many issues with those heading into the furnace and not being able to properly... Uh, tether them back, so I think I might try that today. And if we can just open all the doors up, this is certainly going to be a lot easier. I'm sure any minor decompression event in here is not going to be too big of a deal. Perfect the flip and shake. Yeah, no, we got to work on that too, man. It's a viable approach. They even put it in the tips and tricks video, man. I was watching the the tips and tricks video that the developers uploaded. And they, they alluded to the idea of utilizing a depressurization event to hurdle things into the barge. Like to try to present a hole in the direction of the barge and then open up a door that depressurizes and sends shit flying out. I'm like, that's brilliant, you diabolical bastards. But I tried that and I couldn't get the whole ship to flip around. I guess I better try again. Present your holes. Yeah, I probably could have phrased that better. Also, in, in regards to removing the ECU, I think now, yeah, this is empty. I'm pretty sure that's all you have to do. And yeah, now it's free to go. I'm pretty certain. Cool. Okay. Well, that's easy. We can deal with that later. I'm gonna go back to the front, though. Oh, wait. No, this is the back. 
That's right. Let's see. You know what we could consider? Take all the fuel tanks out and just leave them floating around back here. I don't know if that's necessary to do yet. But I'm thinking about doing that. Let's maybe expose this section for now. Since I don't have a key, of course, that's going to be difficult to flush things properly. Space OSHA. I don't think we have that kind of concern anymore out here. Lynx takes care of everything. Including our safety. Thanks, Lynx. Looking out for all of us. Alright, so this has been separated. Welcome. Shawcred. Thanks for the subscription with Twitch Prime. Welcome on in. Appreciate you. Enjoy your badge and emotes. Bear hugs if you got them. Thanks for the support. Oh, okay. Okay. Let's see. Well, I did say I was going to try to take it apart front to back, but based on what I just did, I'm pretty sure I'm actually still just going to do this. Because this works too. It's a bit odd, but it does the job. I think. Oh, it's not really this time. Hold on a second. What is this panel looking like? We got this whole big thing. This feels like it's disconnected. It may not be because of this one, though. Hmm. Man. You know what? Maybe maybe we do actually try to work front to back this time. Hold on. Let me get in the inside again. Let me get in the crawl space. And let me get up to the front and let me see if we can just cut something away that makes it uh makes it a lot easier for me. Come on now. Someone was even mentioning the possibility of uh your oxygen reserves are low. Oh boy, really? That was no, fast. That excess carbon dioxide can cause damage to Link's equipment. Oh, we've got actually. Hold on, I've got to get the data drive. Data drive. Yeah, no, we're good. Okay. Well, tell you what, I'm gonna take a bit of a gamble. A bit of a gamble. We're going to go through here. I'm going to try to cut these. Well, actually, no. The other side's going to be way better. Yeah, cut this. And see if I can expose the front of the ship real fast. And in turn, allow me to escape and get some O2. That was weird. Well, that's certainly good. There we go. All right, cool. That's open and free. Well, that should go in there. Nice. All right, go. And we get the O2. Okay. So we have access now to the front from the outside, thanks to this panel's disconnection. We'll go ahead and take this for the processor too, why not? I do that so much with those fucking things, man. Oh, Jesus. Processing valuable object. Credit awarded. Okay. Let me try to cut away another part here. So I think if I, let's see. I think if I get this, maybe these two? There we go, okay, we got a big chunk ready to go. Perfect. 
This will be helpful. Yeah, we're going to go for a bit here, Carl. We just got started with shipbreakers, so I'm going to go for a couple hours at least. All right, so if we take this big portion off now, right, this is including the nose rail, so if we go like this, I think we're good. Nice. Okay. And, of course, we just got to get the coolants out of there, too. Oh, that's great. It's a much-needed chill. Good to hear, man. Yeah, glad to provide. Very happy to provide. In you go. Yeah, those tethers are going to do it, man. That's fantastic. That's really good. Easy start. Let's get this heat sink, too. It's pretty simple. Into the corner you go. Man. Quick shift here, dude. Took care of pressurization really easily on this one, at least. Okay, there's another section ready to go. Let's give this another push. Just the recon shift, you know, just the information gathering shift. Let me overuse the tethers here. Just make sure that gets in. And if I cut this little bit down here... Oh, no, this is already off, isn't it? No, it's not. Why is this one connected? Is it to the pipe? The coolant pipe? Which still has coolant in it. Huh. That's odd. Did you finally figure out pressurization? Not really. Not really, to be honest. It's still kind of weird to me. A couple of people have been confirming my suspicion that there's actually not a proper way to fully depressurize the gecko without at least having a minor depressurization event. So, if that's the case, I guess I'm okay with it. It's all about making them as minor as you can. Yeah, and that's fine. I have caressed the pipes, yes. No, that's... I've learned of this. Yeah, you can hear it as it goes through. Use of, use of the hands, I honestly need to try to make more of a part of my pl uh, gameplay because it does seem to be very helpful. Nope, oh, fuck. Always stroke your space pipe, yep. Useful de for depressurization because they stop you from getting sucked out. Ah, oh, yeah. Smart. Such a small feature, but such brilliant design. Yeah, no, it's clear, clear that they spent a lot of time making sure the hands work well, too, which is great. Because they really do. They work great. So, like, if you use the hands here, for example, you can grab onto this thing, I think. Oh, well, no, it's not really going in the right direction for me to do that, though. But you can do that this. There we go. And then like, hi yeah, Yeah. So, it's nice. It's good for quick movement, too. And apparently some people have been saying if you use those through the crawl space, it's a great way to get around quickly. Which is really neat. Okay, so, this is a pretty damn good start despite not getting a ton done. We've actually managed to open up the front of the ship completely and depressurize properly, as mentioned, so that's going to be helpful for us. Get a lot of these coolant tanks out of here, which is going to be helpful, too. I'm going to get a few of the nanocarbon chunks, and then we might even work on the cockpit soon. What I was getting through saying, though, is that I kind of want to consider the possibility of, like, chopping the cockpit completely out of the cabin and then just shooting the cockpit into the barge. I feel like that's a possibility, and that could be pretty cool. A lot of cooling on this ship, yeah. A little interesting, isn't it? Really only saves fuel. It's not actually that much quicker. Oh, really? Okay. You definitely want to see me try that? I'm definitely going to try it. 
Go ahead and take all the roof off of here. I think I actually have to get the rest of these little bits here, too. Yeah, dude, don't I shit. Let's go on the barge? What? That's interesting. Oh, wait a minute. I think I have to... I think I was supposed to take out the power source before I disconnected the rail guide. Warning. Oxygen reserves are low. I guess that's okay, though. Because I'm moving it now. And it seems to be working. Not going to get it in there this time, unfortunately. Eh, that's decent. A decent day. It's a nanocarbon paying my bills here. Using hands is much quicker short distances because of fast acceleration. Right, that makes sense. Okay. Let's get back. Jesus Christ. Sends a little, like it bumps me off of the master jack a little bit and that sends me propelled so far up. It's funny. Okay, get over there. Object accepted for processing. Credits to get over there too. Here we go. A little rail guide processing. Okay. Okay. So most of this stuff is disconnected now. We can go ahead and send the cargo hatch into the processor too. Oh, hang on, I gotta disconnect this bad boy. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight seconds. My god. That's a while. Seven or eight seconds there, holy shit. Long friggin' process, man. Okay, that's that. Let's see about lifting this sucker up a little bit. Actually, you should just be able to do it this way. He is freaking out. Oh, come on. Stop it. Stop it. Stop this. Why? Why do you got it? Fine. You know what? This is what you're doing. All the way over there. If you're going to be difficult... We'll make it a lot easier for you. Okay. I'm gonna pop that one out. Pop that one out. And then I bet I can just shoot this over there. Valuable object processed. Instead of having to use the damn tethers. Gotta fold your sourdough bread though. Ooh. Nummy. Nummy, nummy, nummy. That'll work, I think. Yep, that'll do it. Traction's enough. Hit <laughs> that level of quarantine. Yeah, I was going to make a similar joke. Everybody's either discovered their new newfound love for baking or plants. You know? Hit <laughs> that level months ago. That's fair. It's just every time I do it, it's wild to me how long that takes. I baked and gardened before it was cool. That's fair. And you're a real one, ain't you? And uh, everyone's looking up to you for wisdom. Teach us th the ways of time occupation. Found out it's legal to brew alcohol where you live. That's pretty cool. You've perfected your burgers. What what quarantine skill have you developed, chat? Don't feel shame if you've if your answer is uh, video games, marijuana, and laziness, because I think that's the answer from just about everybody else too. <laughs> or alcohol, depending on your uh, depending on your preferences.
feel personally attacked. Yeah. <laughs> Learning guitar and woodworking. That's pretty good. Hell yeah, man. A renewal. Welcome back. Velasco. 34 months on the pile. Thank you very much for that. You've been raising spiders. Oh, shit. That sounds interesting. Got a new job in quarantine. Hell yeah, that's great. Congratulations. That's certainly unusual, isn't it? Find new work these days. Try a cut next time. It's faster for those panels. Are you talking about like a split saw? For the top guys, probably, huh? Yeah. Well, I, I mean, I know you can cut these quicker with this, too. I've just been being more careful, I guess. What do I really want to do right now? Do I want to... Have I even done... Oh, no, of course I haven't done this, because I've been... Without a key. I guess we could go ahead and... Uh, start separating the rest of these, though, and get these big panels sent off again. Finally got around to planning that D&D &D campaign he'd been putting off for months. All right. So it's not been all bad, huh? Quarantine has had some positive side effects for folks. Yeah, no, you know, new job in quarantine. That is, that is a big pog indeed. That's pretty crazy, man. Oh, fuses. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna try it. Warning. Electrical damage. That's fine. Health levels are low. Links recommends a healthy lifestyle to maximize productivity. I'm not gonna bother picking it up because I know they're glitchy on pickups still, but we do have to remove them. We gotta find one more, I think. Let's see, where are you connected still? Right there. Object accepted for Here we go. Fuse Roda, indeed. Indeed. A 2011 called, by the way. They want their gamer references back. Also, 1998 called me on the phone, and they want their uh, joke structure back. Slash burn structure back. They, they're pretty upset with me that I'm still using this in 2020. They called me on my home phone. Warning. Your oxygen reserves are dropping below statistically profitable levels. Oop. Keeping your gamer heritage alive, yeah. Welcome to Just recalling the AOL days, you know how it is. Hey, let me hit you with a, with a little nostalgia trip, gamers. You ready? Where, where are my dial-up gamers at, huh? Where are my dial-up gamers at? That's my ringtone. <laughs> it was that was like dead on too. I'm gonna I'm gonna let you know if you if you were not privy to those days of online gaming. The sounds that I just produced were almost identical to, to the sounds that we had to listen to every time we wanted to connect to the internet back in the day. It was wonderful. We all loved it. PC PC was not Master Race back then, no, not quite. They were they were working on it. Hey babe, how you doing? Everyone say hi to Elise. Hi, Elise. No, you're going to the barge. It's lunchtime, all right. 
We're just chopping ships up. You know how it is. Went pretty well so far today. I haven't actually blown anything up yet, so that's always good. Yeah, what's for lunch, babe? What you eating? Valuable object processed. Credits awarded. I'm get time for lunch today. She's been working her ass off, y'all. Her place of employment has lost several key staff, and she's been the backbone keeping that ship running. Hey, Samurai, how you doing? Good to have you again. You were there while I made it. I clearly wasn't paying good enough attention. God damn it, what was it? Sorry. <laughs> I have forgotten completely. She's running the ship too, yeah. We, bo we both figured this is the better career trajectory for, for us to take. We got we got to embrace this so, this sort of future sooner than later. You know what I'm saying? I can't just break off the bottom one to do that. Get get off this thing so it can move, please. I'd like this to go over there now. Is this connected still? No, it's not. It's going. It's going. There we go. That'll do it eventually. Or will it? Hold on. Oh, okay. Hold on. That's a little weird. There we go. Get this sucker out of the way, too. Get on out of there. It's just a heavy guy, yeah. Okay, wait for the clearance, and in you go. All right, that might actually get tractioned in, so I don't think I have to do anything about that anymore. Bye, babe. Love you. Nice to see you. For a brief, mo a brief fleeting moment. Salvage secured. Account credit applied. Okay. Da -da -da. Down you go, down you go, down you go, down you go, down you go. Down you go. All the way in, all right. We're just gonna move that over a second. And I think this is free, isn't it? No, it's not. I'm gonna cut it somewhere. Oh, is it? No, there's another cut point down there too. So strange they've got these here, though. Let's we'll take this off. There we go. That's all. Up and over. Can we just skip 20 centuries of space travel and get to this point? I wouldn't mind it. If we could just real quick fast forward to here, I'd be okay with that. I can't believe that tether is stuck around the whole time. All right, they're both going in, sick. We just got more nano carbon to send in here too, man. Fuck it. Fuck it. Do it. Take it all, baby. Take it all. This one's not cut yet. There we go. Oh man, we're looking good now. Looking real good now. Awesome. Up and over. This front to back method's working out really well, I think. It's doing the job real nicely, man. Okay, we've got a cut here. Right there? No, what's that? Hold on. That's not it. Where's the cut on this thing? I think it's just these two. Heard you're always supposed to wipe front to back. 
Turns out it's good advice. Right, we're gonna take this big ass titanium chunk out of here. Reminder, Just kidding. Can lead to salvage quotas. Apparently not. What are you doing? Get in there. Weirdo. Um, this one is not free either. We gotta do some more cutting. Time is winding down, Cutter. Dig deep and let's finish strong. We actually got more O2 here than time remaining, so that's good. This is divided with the airlock attaching it, probably. So if we cut that off. Oh, is it the heat sink? No, it's not the heat sink. What is it? What's connecting you? Is it this? No, this isn't connecting you either. What the heck? Where are you connected? Oh, up here. Okay, so if I... Hmm. Interesting. We're gonna handle that. I guess we'll find out next time. Yeah. Hey, two million. That's pretty good. Shipping crates are worth a ton. Gotta make sure I get those. Yeah, I think I will just cut that airlock out. It's probably not a bad idea. Only 424000 for our debt now. That's pretty nice. The cutter rental is such a huge chunk if we can get that. Okay. Repair. Let's keep going. Where are we at for qualifications? Good question. We got to get all these work orders complete. I know that for sure. Certification word. Yeah, we're, we're, we're working on a lot of stuff. Lots of electrical we gotta get from this, so. Plenty left to do. <laughs> See, I could've used my hands there to grab that instead of slamming gently into it, but I guess that works too. Slamming gently, that's, yep. That's what I said. That's what I said. Salvage secured. Account credit applied. It doesn't feel like these things are going to be easily destroyed, so I'm feeling pretty confident about just, like, bouncing them around like that. There we go. That one's good to go. And as mentioned several times, got to make sure that we get the, uh... Salvage deposit accepted. Credits transferred. Got to make sure we get the shipping crates. They're very important. We'll just make this cut here. Fuck it. Or these cuts, I should say. There we go. Goody, goody, goody. And we just gotta separate this from here. And then bring that off as well. I think that's off there now. Yep, we're good. Well, that's disconnected too. Nice. I think that'll get in there. I gotta get another separation here too. Good. All right. That gentle push has been enough to make this easy. Ow. That'll go in there. No sweat. I hope. Yep, we're good. Salvage secured. Account credit applied. All right, man. Let's get some more chunks inside. I think that one's good to go, as well as the one right next to it. Just want to make sure there's nothing else on the interior that we need to grab. I don't think so. We're good. This is feeling good, man. A good situation here with this ship. And over 
here now. Processing valuable object. Credits awarded. And this big old chunk as well that I've hit myself with several times, but I've managed not to do so that time. That's in there. Hell yeah, man. Okay. Now, time to worry about the airlock. What if we were to just sever the top portion off? I think that might actually do it. First of all, I gotta get the other consoles in here, because they're worth a decent chunk of cash on their own. Hand's doing a lot better today, Coffee. Thanks for asking. Now, the wrist is feeling much better. I think I did, a, did myself a lot of favors uh, rearranging the desktop setup today. And uh, I've got a lot more space for, for my wrist, so I feel a lot better. Feeling good. Ready for ship breaking today. Okay, cool. We're doing a really good job with this one, I gotta say. I'm pretty proud with how this has gone so far. Really smooth. I haven't really missed much. I don't think I've destroyed anything, in fact. I don't think I've seen a single destroyed on the uh, post-shift report. Feels good. we got to make some more disconnections here. And we got this rail connector up here, too. Famous last words. Yeah, no, I shouldn't have jinxed it, I'm sure, but... So far, so good, at least. Just a little bit more for the rail. Oh, no, that's it. That is it for that. Okay. In you go. Like a light hunting for those extra electrical items. You may not be wrong about that, actually. Yeah, it's not a bad idea. Is it just me where there are a lot more lights in the, um... You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna end up taking those words back immediately, immediately after I say them. Because it's probably just me not looking for the lights on the, on the gecko. I was gonna say there's more lights on the mackerel, but that's probably not the case. Thought the lights didn't count as electrical devices? Let's find out. They do not. Oh, well, that sucks. Fuck, why, why, why ever get lights then? They're completely useless. That's totally bogus. Oh, well. I suppose it's good to still have them as part of the ship, but it just seems a little silly. What tier ship? This is a tier six? Seven? Seven. Tier seven. I'm rank seven. Okay. Well. We got this and that. Both going in the processor. So over you go. These are all now just still connected here. I gotta get these fuel tanks off. I think there might be one or two more. Yeah, this is the problem here. go. Just a couple connections up top. Doo -doo. Morning. Oxygen reserves are low. Let me go ahead and get this one out of here too. Just push it. <sighs> push it real good. Uh, push it. Ah. Push it real good. Ugh. Is this song talking about pooping? They're talking about pooping in that song? They're talking about encouraging a good poop? Push it! TLC's just been trying to promote healthy bowel movements all this time. No, I'm with you. I'm with you, Coffee. Yeah. That's a noble pursuit. Someone's got to do it. Oh, salt and pepper. My bad. Sorry. 
<laughs> Mel Bear, salt and pepper has been about healthy bowel movements for years. TLC has just had terrible diarrhea. <laughs> Never mind, I'm sorry. I don't even feel proud of that. That's disgusting. Mouth! Space! TLC are all about healthy urinary tracts. That's what Waterfalls was all about. Ah, okay, there we go. Yeah, you're 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 right. You're right. Mm-hmm. Yep. Thank you very much for the gifted sub. Amazingly Libby. Or amazing Libby. Sorry to say. Appreciate that. I knew I was going to do it again! I didn't fucking do that, man! Do you think that's what I want, game? When I take the fuel tank off, do you think I want to fucking hurl it into the wall at full speed? Why? Early access, everybody. Fuck. So dumb. Uh, I was doing so well, man. That's upsetting. It's so fucking stupid. I always have fuel and stuff still going through them, so I gotta be careful here. How am I even gonna... How have I not cleared out all the coolant, man? All right, Cutter, you got five minutes left of this shift before they turn the lights out on you. Need a pattern. We drop. It's still in there? That makes no sense. It just it does not make sense. That's illogical. <sighs> Not to mention, I can't possibly see how we could have any fuel left. Fallen angry cryos. Welcome back into the pile. Thank you very much. Thank you for using your Twitch Prime. Appreciate it. No, when I'm on object sensor, though, I'm pretty certain that it shows me the liquid in the pipes this way. Like, I think it does. Oh, I'm on object. No, that's when I'm on structural. Okay. Ah, God, that explains it. Fuck. See, I was. Yeah, you were right. Because when you're in structural, it does show you the tubes are empty. I'm pretty sure, anyway, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's an empty tube. I would I would be able to hear fluid in there if that was if that was full still. Yeah, same story. Okay, so those are empty. Which means all I have to do now is this. There. Now this is free. Okay. Pardon that bit of salt. 
But I was doing so goddamn well. I'm, I, I was so genuinely disappointed with that, man. I was doing so goddamn good on this ship. And to have that random nonsense happen is so frustrating. Oh, this is connected to the... What? That's odd. Okay. No, still? This is so strange. So strange. There we go. That should disconnect. Okay, that's free from there. Better than picking up a fuse and being hurled into a wall so hard your helmet falls apart. <laughs> yeah, no, you're probably right. That's a little glitchy. Okay, there we finally disconnect all this shit, too. All right. Well, hey. We may have lost $1.3 million of thruster value. But we still have our reactor, damn it. Which is still... Like, inexplicably... By some miracle still attached to this shit. Wait, hold on. What if I just do these ones? Your oxygen reserves are dropping below statistically profitable levels. That'll probably do it. No oh, killers, thank you. Appreciate it. Hope you're doing well. It's still attached! How? How? No! No, no. Just game? No. You're wrong. You are wrong. This is incorrect. I'm gonna lose my mind. Thank Christ. Oh man, okay, SQL server. Thanks for the gifted subs. You have returned. I appreciate that. Welcome on into the pile, everybody. Bear hugs for him if you got him. I got $75 for that pipe junction. Welcome to the bear pile. Four grand for the fuel pipes. They're just so useless. Thank you for the bear hugs. Appreciate it. All right, man. Welcome well, to the bear pile. Still plenty of money to be made from this ship, despite the, the appearances of things. Let's keep going. Welcome to the bear pile. Yeah, it looks a little bit worse for wear, obviously, but still plenty to get. You know what? While I'm here, let's get the let's get the power generator. Fuck it. Real quick. And then into the corner of the barge with you. Here we go. All right. Let's get the ECU too. Actually, let's get no. Let's let's take this wall out. No, no. Let's do the floor. I'm gonna do the floor. I guess I'll just take this over there. That's good enough, too. Yeah, floor time, baby. Hey, Spike. Anything that touches an item is considered as attached. I just wish that wasn't the case. It's just, it's such a satisfying game in so many ways that when things like that happen, it just becomes that much more frustrating because I want it all just to work. The way it appears to... Or the way that it seems it should, you know what I'm saying? There we go, man. There's our ACU. Made that pretty easy. Yeah, instead we have to deal with the explanation of, oh, they're using super strong space glue to attach the pipes together. See you time. Nice. Salvage secured. Credits deposited. Space glue. 
Mm-hmm. Now we very well may spend some time uh, barge collecting today. But I also think I still want to go with that plan of cutting the cockpit out entirely and just dumping it in the barge. So I'm pretty sure I'm still going to do that too. That might hit something. Oh, nice. Now, I think we cut out this floor. We're doing. We're gonna do our selves a favor too, but as we've seen before, it's likely that there's going to be some sort of structural um, storage bin or mattress or something underneath here, so i got to be con concerned about that here. I also still haven't gotten the reactor, but we'll get there. Structural poster, yeah. Oh, shit, it came free. Ah, oh, just kidding. No, it didn't. I was expecting this. Not that. Not that. Not that either. What the heck is it? Is it the mattress? It's probably the mattress. No? Really? Huh. That's weird. What is it? Um, there's nothing else in here. Oh, is it this? Yeah, it's this. Yep, there it was. Last thing. Hey there, Rose. Uh, rank seven, I believe now. Cert rank seven. It's gonna be a long time, unfortunately, before I get to cert rank eight. It's a ways away. Let's go ahead and put all this stuff in. Although I know, unfortunately, that the crew beds and the mattresses and all that shit aren't really worth anything, unfortunately. So it may not even be worth the investment of time to get them. Salvage deposit accepted. Credits transferred. How much time to get to this point? It was about 20 hours or so. Maybe 15. Oh, the mattress is furnace, isn't it? Yeah, I forgot. Salvage secured. Credits deposited. That's okay. In you go. You go in there too. Good food pack. I whole buffaloed one of those after three shifts. Damn, nice. Impressive. Pretty quick. I'm still so salty because I was doing so well on this one. This was like our best ship yet. And then boom. Blink of an eye. Those fuel tanks just fucking obliterate everything. Okay. That's pretty good. Let's get the reactor. Probably a good idea now. Very little left over here. I had a rear end blowout. Yeah, it went a little south. South in the south end. You know, we'll just... While we've got the presence of mind to do it, I'm just going to go ahead and send that over yonder. Since it's such a big chunk ready for processing. And then the rest of this... We'll send into furnace scrap. Just so we have less shit over here. Oh, that's going into the goddamn furnace, isn't it? Yep. Whatever, so be it. It was happening anyway. We knew it was going to happen. I gotta go ahead and refill, too. Shut up. Shut up, lady. I know. 
How is this still processor? That's absurd. I know that is. Well, let's see if I can make it. Might as well. You missed the good part already. Yeah, sorry, Barrick. It's so strange how so many of those are processors still. There we go. I know, I know. We are fuck! Okay. Whew. That went well. All right. Get over here. Piece of crap. Piece of crap. There we go. And then get inside. Get in there. I also never get tired of the music. It is delightful. Look at this whole big chunk here, too, don't we? That's processor. That's processor ready, man. Get over there. That's also processor. Object accepted for processing. We actually hit our nanocarbon quota, too. Wow, look at us go. One's going in too. Nice. Wow. Still salvaged a lot of that despite the destruction. Kind of feels good. Like I turned around a disaster a little bit. This is. I'm just obsessed with this now. Deposit accepted. Trying to clean up the wreckage. Make it look a little bit more decent at least. There we go. All right, cool. Not too bad, actually. Clean the wreckage, hide the shame, yep. Good enough. Material deposited. Good enough for now. Let's actually get this sucker out of here. Oh, come on. You're not stuck, are you? It's just kind of difficult to get it through this little hole, I guess. There we go. Get out of there. Come on. You know what? I'm just going to bump it. Oh, yeah. No, tons of people have said that, Samurai. The music definitely has a Firefly vibe to it. You're definitely not the first. I'm just going to pop it. There we go, dude. There we go. Don't let it get in the furnace. That's not what Welcome we do with that. To the bear pile. Bio madness. Thank you very much for your Twitch Prime. Appreciate that. Welcome on into the pile. Enjoy your badge and emotes. Raw material process. Credit deposit. Here we go. Here we go. All right, apparently it doesn't want to get out of the casing. So we'll just do that. I guess that works. I hope. Please work. Please get in there. Get in! Get in! Oh my god. Took way too long. That song is awesome, though. I love that. Let's punch more chunks up here. All right, good enough. 
Kind of lucky that didn't blow up. Yeah, we got fortunate there. All right. We got three minutes. I think that's enough time to try to cut off the cockpit. Let's get these other two heat sinks as well, because they're worth a decent amount of money. In you go. I have watched one episode of Firefly, and I liked it a lot. I'm not actually sure why I haven't watched any more after that. I definitely should. Pretty sure I'd like it a lot. That was structural, wasn't it, for this particular portion of nanocarbon? That's funny. That is funny. All right, well, there we go then. All right, let's try to cut this cockpit. We're going to have to do it real fast here. I'm just going to slice her off. I'm not going to worry about what's inside. Go. Cut it off. Cut it completely off. I'm not going to have nearly enough time for this here. Go from the bottom. Okay. There we go. Good. I'll figure it out on my own, fetus. I'm just kind of testing right now. See what I can do. If I do this, that'll work out too, right? Come over around here. Come all the way through. Hey, April, how's it going? You're not breaking the ship enough? Oh, you weren't here earlier then. You clearly missed me breaking the ship a lot. Reminder, asphyxiation can lead to missed salvage quotas. That is not separated, is it? Hold on. There we go. Yo, okay, no, I haven't done it yet, but I think I'm close. I think I'm actually close. I kind of want to come back for one more shift. I think I'm going to. Because I, I want to do this. I blame everyone else. That's fair. It is everyone else's fault. $4.5 million still, despite all the damage, man. That's pretty good. My work order's looking okay, too. Knocked out a few of them. We got no fuel, of course. <laughs> yeah, yeah, let's keep working on this sucker. Mm-hmm. Gonna have like 20 bucks. I don't have any money to give you, sorry. I've actually got negative 935 million dollars, so I'd, I'd like to borrow 20 bucks if that's okay. Okay, back to it. What about 350? 350, sorry, what's wrong with me? Moron. All right, we've got a little bit left to cut on this, I think. Let's go ahead and get the cool intake out of here, too. I've nearly actually disconnected this, haven't I? That's dope. Uh, yeah. Oh, look. That's interesting. We cut this panel off. Okay. Oh my god. Ah! Okay. So. Oh, hold on. Let's get these off. Because that'll just totally separate it from this po portion, I think. That should work well. I hope, anyway. Wait, no. What's this even doing? Hmm. Hmm. 
Well, I haven't made this cut yet. So I suppose this could be the difference maker. I gotta get this one too, I guess. Don't forget the bins also hold them together. Oh, that's true. Yeah, I might have to get rid of a structural storage bin. I think I gotta get this cut done as well. Actually go up all the way through it. Hmm. This is much tougher than I thought it would be. What if I get this? Oops. Oh no, we're good, we're good. That's still all connected, man. The weight dropped? It separated? These are all still just separate parts, unfortunately. Hmm. I don't think it's separated yet. The storage bins, like we said, though, could be the structural component keeping us from doing this. So what if we did this first? Which is kind of defeating the purpose of knocking the cockpit into the barge, but... To allow us to actually do it Salvage would be nice. I don't know if that's even going to help, though. It's so confusing. Can you just put the entire ship in the incinerator? Yeah, you can, but you destroy a whole bunch of shit, and I don't know if it's even worthwhile. Probably not. You probably destroy more than you get value out of that. Where in the world am I missing? A disconnect point. It must be the storage bin. Cockpit roof? Oh, here we go. What if we just do this? Still connected. Hey, Death, doing pretty good. How you doing? Still connected. Hmm. It doesn't even look like it is anymore, though, is the thing. It's not! Oh, shit! Wait, it is. No, it isn't. Is it? I can't tell. It's moving! A generous bestow. Paradox Hero! Thanks for the 1,500 biddies, dude. Appreciate that. Yo, it's moving from that side. But only from that side. Hmm. So how do we disconnect the other end, then? Maybe it's still the storage bins. A renewal. Let's tether Welcome this like back. that. To get it actually out and moving. Oh, never mind. That's not going to work. What am I thinking? I'm going to do like that. Come on. Come on. You were moving. I saw. I saw you moving. It's going a little bit, I think. It's going a little tiny bit right now. The casing is moving, not the cockpit. Oh, this is moving? This giant fucking thing is moving? Have we separated this from the cockpit, though? Because that would work. We did! Cool! That's pretty neat. Alright. Nice. Good work. Deposit accepted. And then that tether might actually still get this big chunk, so... Let's get to work. Oh, no, 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 what we wanted to do still is just sever this from here somehow, which I might be able to do that. What if we just, hold on. Like this? Where do we cut this off? Where in the heck do we cut this off of here? Maybe there? Hmm. I think this might work. Getting the last one here, I think this might do it. Yeah! There we go, man. All right. The cockpit is free. You are now free to freely move the cockpit. 
Down you go. <laughs> that's great, man. Oh, that's that's satisfying. Let's see what it counts. Got the bin. I think you got it. Or most of it. Or it might have only counted one storage bin. I guess we'll find out. We're looking at a um, Gecko Cert Rank 7 ship here. That's what we're working with. Oxygen level stabilizing. You might have to go down and push the rest into it. Maybe, uh, we'll go check. Ah, there we go. Yeah, that got a little bit more. We just gotta keep shoving it around to get all the other stuff. <laughs> That's really funny, actually. <laughs> to get all the rest of the things, you just have to shove it in there over and over. Credits <laughs> transferred. All right, I think that's the last of it. Whee! Ah, help! There we go. All right, dude. Not a ton left. We got some door consoles in the airlock I could get, but I might just eat the rest of it into the furnace. Slash processor. We'll get the bigger chunks while we can here first. The obvious stuff to take care of. Oh, we gotta cut this chunk out, don't we? This is just one big panel of aluminum. There we go. Oh, it's still connected? To what? Oh, to that. Whoops. Shit. Didn't mean to do that. Get out of here. Come on. I'm, I actually don't think I can cut this beam. Yeah, I can't. So I'll have to... Oh, this isn't even worth it, man. It's not at all worth it to sever this off, but I've already committed. There we go. All right, let's do it. Get you in there. Get this big old chunk in there. I have to wait, I guess, on that one, though. Hold on, I'm just going to send this with a few tethers. Connecting. There we go. That should do it. Okay, good. All right, Cutter, you got five Down to five again. My God. The the Happened so fast. Yeah, there goes that one. That should be quick enough on its own. Door console time. Almost just busted that against that wall there. Go. Processing so much now. Secured. And I think a lot of this goes into the furnace. Besides this, which I will sever off now. And the other side as well. And then into the processor. Goodbye. You are going this way. Have a fun trip. Into the incinerator. Goodbye. Bon voyage. Have fun. It's been real. It's been super real. Okay. There's that big old chunk. 
More tethers now. We'll see. Well, it'll do. That'll do for now. We'll just send the rail guide along with him. This guy will get a few, though. There you go. Material deposited. Destroyed a small aluminum panel. Not a big deal. Rail guide going in. This ought to work. This ought to do it. There we go. All right, and the big old airlocks. This apparently goes in the barge. I don't know what the heck I'm going to do with that. This whole aluminum structure is supposed to go in the barge? That's funny. That ain't happening. Like, fun is that happening? All right, yeah, I'm supposed to do this. Oh, wait, no. Fuck it, just cut the whole airlock off. Cut the whole fucking thing off here. Destroy it. Sever it. Remove it from existence. There we go, baby. That's how you take care of that. Problem solved. Give me that access ladder. Perfect. That thing's got to be worth a cool mill at least. On its own, right? Cut the airlock. Yeah, who needs airlocks? Exactly. Frivolous luxuries, the things. Deposit not accepted. Well, that's your problem. I'm giving you perfectly good material here. All right, man. There's that. Your oxygen reserves are low. Note that excess carbon dioxide can cause damage to Link's equipment. I think it's time to send these into the furnace, man. Let's do it. Time is winding down, Cutter. I think for once we're actually going to get the last giant chunks of titanium. Which is almost always something we miss out on. Please revisit your training. Let's do it. No reason to save tethers here. Warning. No tethers remaining. Goodbye, ship. We salute. We salute, chat. A gecko that served us well. And that's it. That's the whole lot of it, man. That's a Z and X, Jatarna. There we go, man. That's a job well done, I'd say. That's the whole buffalo for what it's worth. And what it's worth is about $12 million to us. A couple mil right there. Cool. And we did manage to get most of the storage bins. Oh my god, I thought the access ladder was actually worth $126,000, but I mistook that for the rail guide. Oh shit, that was gonna blow my mind. Alright. Yeah, time for another shift, let's do it. See if I can go without blowing this one up. That'd be nice. Let's take a look, another look at the cert. We need to get a lot of electrical equipment. A lot of coolant, too. All right. Thunder Oberon sounds pretty cool. They're all pretty similar. Let's go with that. Works for me. Away we go. Start with the antenna, as is tradition. See, as long as I don't bust the antenna open, 
feel like I've got a good ship. I feel like I've got a solid chance of success. I don't know that blowing them up is that inefficient. Well, it certainly costs us a lot of money. Really not something I'd prefer to do. It does help me out a lot if you use that tracking link and buy the game Lurith, so... There's that, but it doesn't necessarily, like, directly financially benefit me if you do that. Alright, so you know what? I think I'm just gonna have to accept some minor decompression events. Just accept that that, that such is life. In this world. I'm gonna hang on to the walls and the doors just in case. Try to help myself out that way, I guess. All right, here we go. Hang on, hang on. Oh, that does make it a lot better, doesn't it? Yeah, if you just hang on to the wall while that's happening, it's not really a big deal at all. Okay, cool, that, there's that. This one's opened up, I think we're good. No sweat. <coughs> Pardon me. We gotta open these up now as well. Airlock pressure levels dropping. Over here. Airlock pressure levels dropping. Of course, we still have no keys. It's still. I love that it still does the force push, even if you use the F key to try to use the key. It's just prone to disaster. Let's go ahead and open up the back again. And hopefully this way, I don't know what it is, man, but <clears throat> I'm terrified now to try to attempt to disconnect these fuel things. So we're going to take off the entire back section, disconnect that and bring it forward, and then, then take the fuel tanks off once it's pulled away from the fucking thrusters. And hopefully that'll go better. Damn, that sounds pretty cool, Fox. I'll have to get back to Grifflands at some point. I don't think I have to do this one, but I might as well. Is that? Oh, yeah, it frees that up, doesn't it? That's cool. Okay, now these are still connected, of course, with the thrusters, though, so... No, that's right. I can't disconnect these panels because of the thrusters. God damn it, man. What am I supposed to do? When I take these off, they fucking fly around and blow up the ship. I cannot rely on these to disconnect gently. I could cut around them, I guess. That's true. That's an interesting consideration. Hmm. Wait, no, I can't cut this because it's nanocarbon. Never mind, I can't do that at all. I can't remove everything around. The, the, the danger of removing these is these thrusters being here, and I can't remove the thrusters until I remove these. It's a catch-22. There's a flush valve, but if I do that while they're connected, then it doesn't work. Because that's 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 a risk. Oh no, hold on. Okay, no, now they're disconnected. Okay, no, I was I was mistaken. I thought that the I thought you had to disconnect the thrusters first. Never mind. I just missed a cut point. We're good. We're good. There we go. All right, we're gonna do the same thing here. Put the other on the master jack. Get that one way up there. Actually, I think that one's gonna be the only one that grabs it, so we'll have to do that with both. That's okay, though. So this will pull up like so. And should finally free us to actually to actually, um, I don't know, this isn't gonna work, is it? Ah, oh, shit. 
shit. Let me down. Fuck. There's nowhere to get through anymore now. Unless I... Okay, hold on. If I... If I do this... I'm gonna flip the whole ship doing that. Why not, though, right? Is that enough space now? I'm so slowly inching over here. My god. Get in there. Ah, fuck. It's just not enough room. There we go. Come on. Let me in. Thank you. Good god. Hmm. How do I actually want to do this? I think it, you know what? No, I like this still. I like this place still. I'm doing this still. I'm doing it. I'm committing. I'm pushing up with my back. I'm lifting with my shoulders here, chat. That's proper lifting technique. There we go. Just push this sucker up. No, actually, you're you're supposed to use your legs, actually. That's right. Yeah, lift with your lower back bear, right. Lift only using your spine. Okay. These have been pulled off a little bit, at least. What if we... Oh, you know what? Yep, no, people have been saying pull it to the back wall. You're right. Warning. Your oxygen you're totally right. Pull it to the back wall. That, that'll be way easier. Unless you do that, apparently. Did not realize that part could be disconnected. Oops. No, come on. How is this this heavy? What the fuck? It's it's such a tiny pe you really want to go in the furnace, you really do. Can you not? Oh fuck you. The furnace is big suck. Yeah. It's got big sucking power. Speaking of which, wow! That was fast. There we go. Okay, cool. We did it. We did it. Now, for the love of God, please, disconnect it gently. Please. I'm standing perfectly still, okay? I'm standing still. I'm just gonna remove it. Oh my God, wow! It worked! Not so close to it, Barry. No, I get close to it because when I'm far away, it flings it out into fucking nowhere. You have returned. I gotta be close to it. Brizzle! Thanks for the four months. Welcome on back and appreciate your resubscription. All right, man. We did it. We salvaged fuel. Salvage secured. Yeah. Now we can do this. Because there's no more fuel for this thruster, right? Right? Right. Nope. Fuck. Uh. Are we good? We good? I'm gonna take it. I'm just gonna take it. I'm gonna put it in there, okay? Alright, great. Great. Every, everyone's happy. We did it. Now, you... 
you need to make your way well over there and not go to the furnace, okay? Don't do it. Don't do it. You better not. I'm watching. I'm watching you closely. He's gonna pull the whole friggin' ship with it. Gonna go bonk. Bonk. Oh, hold on. I guess I could get this. Hang on. Oh. Nice. Oh, that's going processor too. Okay, never mind. That's just a waste of time. I don't think I've messed up yet. No, so far so good. I don't know if that's just what people are waiting for these days. You missed it if you were looking for me to just blow up the ship. That happened earlier. Yeah, this is actually going pretty well. Let's try again. You know what? I refuse to take any chances, though. Let's apply the same process to this part here as well. I guess it doesn't really matter. Well, no, I shouldn't just. Uh, there's no point in doing that. Yay! Oh my god, dude, every time I'm panicked about it. And every time it just gently comes off. Oh, it's such a friggin' relief. Alright, let's do this again. Well, actually, you know what? Take all the fuel off and then do that. Maybe that'll actually solve the problem. Maybe that'll fix what I've been doing here. Engage safety squints. Is this even... Yeah, it's moving, okay. You can see the lights on the fuel tube are lit. That means it's still full. Okay. So these ones are empty. These ones are full. Okay. Cool. Good to know. Thank you. Okay, please. Please. I'm begging you. I'm begging you. Help me out. Come on. Come on. Yes! Ooh. Into the barge. Last one. Come on. Come on. No! Oh, come on, man! Why? It didn't blow anything else up. We're saved. We're saved. Our precautions worked. Yay! Oh, God. There's still fuel in here somehow. Is it from the front? Dude, those fuel tanks are fucking buggy. I really hope they fix those. <laughs> that is not okay. Oh, I just have to vent it. Okay. One minute left. Cutter. Gotcha. Time to start wrapping things up. We wrap. Yeah. Ow. Electrical damage. Note that excess electrical damage has been found to negatively impact long-term job satisfaction. <laughs> so good. I died. Your vital signs have been lost. Please reboot your monitor. Come on. No. Oh, there's still time in the shift. Just ignore the, the, the corpse of your former self resting in the crawl space. Just get back to work real quick, please. Thank you. Yeah, apparently fuses want me dead. 150k per clone, yikes. That's expensive. Okay, there we go. Thrusters vented. Those will be ready for next shift. 
Ugh, put the corpse in the furnace. <laughs> okay. You can pull fuses with the grapple. Ah, okay, that probably saved me some trouble. I don't have that many more repair kits, actually, shit. Hmm. I don't need that. Why can't I? Oh, I have to get this first. Okay. That's interesting. These resistances don't really seem that worthwhile to me, but... I guess I should probably get electrical resistance now. Yeah, no, that's fair. That's fair. Are you sure you don't need it? Yeah. <laughs> God damn it. I'm quite conductive right now, yeah. Well, not too bad so far. Certainly working from back to front on this one. And this whole big thing is still totally processable. Wants to get that done. Whoop, fuck. I, I wish you could just cancel one tether. I wish there was a button to cancel the most recently made tether. That would be nice. Raw material processed. Credits deposited. Will this even being a little more thorough as... Or just about as thorough as last time. Control Z, yeah, that'd be nice. Okay. Big old chunks in there, too. Pretty good. Okay, good stuff. You know what? I think I can just bump these down there, can't I? In you go. Just grabbing 1.5 million worth of thrusters real quick here. No big deal. No big deal, baby. Blue fuel line is coolant. You disable by removing coolant. Purple is fuel disabled by inputting key. Gotcha. Yeah, no, I gotcha. I, I've heard that, but it's just a matter of properly doing it that's still a mystery to me. But I think I'm, I'm figuring it out more now. Really, the only mystery at this point is how the fuck I prevent the fuel tanks from exploding on me. That seems unavoidable sometimes. Cancel a tether with a V key. Then, of course, as I just mentioned, it cancels all your tethers. Valuable object processed. Credits deposited. So I need to disconnect these by cutting the glue pipe, I guess. Which would be this one? Or both of these ones? There's so many fucking small bits. There we go. That's disconnected. Good. And this isn't even worth anything, but I'll put it in there anyway. I might as well. That should do it. Processing valuable object. Credits awarded. We got a good chance here of being able to. Uh... Hold on, let me do that. Fuck. Knew it. Got a good chance here of being able to get the reactor right now, though. Oh, this one's free, too. Hold on. Go like that. And bada bing, bada boom. There we go. Glad to hear it, Hyper Taco. It's been real nice for me, too. I really love making content out of this game. Did those sever? They sure did, didn't they? Yeah. Damn. Um, just a little bit more, and then boom. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
Shit. Shit. Save it. Save it, please. No. God, why? <laughs> no, save it, please. You can save it. You can save it, Bear. You can save the big chunk from going in the furnace. Please, get it out. Get it out. No, 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 no. No! Fuck. It's such a big suck. Such a strong suck. He was so young. He didn't have to go. Why, why, why couldn't it have been me? This one as well. It, it could be you if you wanted, yeah. I still haven't tried flying into the furnace. That's been a common request. Welcome to the bear pile. Dorian Bride Testa. Welcome to the bear pile. Thanks for your subscription. Appreciate it. You got a double echo. Look at you. This has actually been disconnected here, hasn't it? No, not this part. So I gotta get into that. But this is ready for processing too. Yo, we are making quick work of the back end here. This is looking good. I'm gonna go ahead and get the uh, reactor out. Unless, oh wait, hold on. No, we, we flushed both, right? Yeah, yeah, we did, we're good. Let me up. Valuable object processed. Credit deposited. Good to go, baby. Oh, apparently not. No, I absolutely, I remember now. No, I definitely did not disconnect the ECU. Fuck, that was a mistake. Oops. Yeah, totally goofed that. I did not, I did not do this first. That's a big whoops though. Oh no, I hit the F key in here. Reminder, asphyxiation can lead to mixed salvage quotas. Good God. <laughs> well, I hope I don't shatter the ECU. That would be bad. This is still okay. This is still fine. How's this not being destroyed? Thank you. There we go. Okay. Oh, it's still connected. Is it because of these? I thought I got rid of this. Oxygen reserves are critical. Please contact your plan administrator to have asphyxiation coverage. Oh, hey. Here we go. Let's get this too. Sure. Caution. Tether supplies running low. Is this clone glitchy? It must be, yeah. Welcome to Vendatron Nine Thousand. There we go. Stabilizing. Super easy way to tell if there's stuffs and pipes at a glance. I know of two. You can put your hands up on them and hear or and listen for it. Then you can also go into the scanner and look real quickly that way. Are those the two you're talking, or is that one of the methods you're talking about? Salvage secured. Credit deposited. Okay. This is still, why are you connected? Confused. Oh, the little lights on them too, right? Yeah, no, somebody told me that just a little while ago as well. I, I forgot immediately, apparently. But right, yeah, the lights. I guess I gotta cut the cage around it, huh? Yeah, no, I've been able to disconnect it without doing that, though. 
Huh. Well, all right. It's still the pipes? Seriously? Yep, sure enough. There we go. Fuck it, let's just send it down. I think I do have to take it out of there first, though. And now we can do this. We've got about five minutes left in this shift, Cutter. Don't bite off more than you can chew. There he goes. Good stuff. All right. Let's do some more cutting. Get these shells out of here. We'll go front to back on the remainder of the shells, though, I think. That'll probably be easier. Ooh, I gotta get that cargo hatch off of here, too. That's right. Hey, Nacelle. Holy shit. It's been a minute since we saw that. Who's this? Oh, it's a fuse. That was dangerous. Jesus. <laughs> I guess the coolant's already out, though, so we're probably fine. I wonder if I'm going to sever my cockpit again. Hey, lady, how you doing? I love how that one just yeets itself away once it's disintegrated. Remember to buy some repair kits before the shift ends. Ah, good call. Yeah, no, I definitely need some of those. Fucking nacelle time, man. Let's go. Unusual sight. Oh, no, never mind. This is a sensor array. New stuff. Y'all just going to replay to blow stuff up? I have done that once, actually. It was a lot of fun. I, I loaded up a, an industrial class uh, gecko in free play. Literally just started shooting the shit out of it willy-nilly blowing everything up to little pieces but after doing that literally after just randomly firing away with my split saw completely absent-mindedly in some somehow in some way the reactor was still salvageable after blowing this the entire ship to bits the reactor was still just chilling in there and i got it and i'm pretty sure had it been career mode I probably would have made some money on the shift. Just from that alone. Which I thought was pretty funny. We'll have to try to uh, employ that approach next time on the, on, the, on the mackerel. Or on the gecko, I mean. Just shoot the shit out of it and see what happens. Oh damn, we got some storage crates. Shipping crates, I mean. Easy, dude. Easy money. Oh, God. Slow down. Fuck. We go like that. There we are. Easy. Okay. And this one's ready to go too, right? now. this is the cockpit one, that's right. Let's go ahead and get these out of here too. I think I'm all about getting the majority of the shell 
disposed of today. Here we go. Yeah, the industrial ships do seem a little easier to work with. The, the transport geckos are kind of tough. A little tougher than most, anyway. All right, that should free up quite a bit. Might as well go through the last of these, though. And then we'll have a lot of shell shopping to do. Next time. This whole big chunk of titanium is freed, I believe. Yep, that's awesome. <clears throat> All right, good shift. Oh, I forgot the repair kits. I knew it. Five million gold credits, dollars, whatever you want to call them. Five million of them. Pretty good. Pretty good, man. That makes me happy. I'll get repair kits next time, I promise. In fact, I'll buy them immediately. Right now. Five million monies. Welcome to Metatron 9000. There we go. Thank you for your purchase. There we go. <coughs> Pardon me. This is free, right? Yeah. Totally. Reactor days do feel great, for sure. Feeling wealthy, baby. There's no coolant in there either. Hell yeah, that is gone. what I do to earn that massive debt? Bought too much avocado toast. That's a bad joke. Come on, bear. Salvage secured. Credits deposited. You can do better. Okay, hold on. If I... If I do this... Is this disconnected? It is disconnected already. Nice. Man, get on up out of here. Oh, that's not going to work, though. Unless I do this first. Which I can do happily. You are getting tractioned, I believe. Just very, very slowly. So, that'll work. Save the shipping crates. Get up, get up, get up. Come on. Come on. There we go. Slide this sucker out of there too. This and the uh, giant titanium thing need to get in there as well. All right, shipping crate down. You go into the barge. Yeah, that should work. Save these bad boys. And then we got one more cut to make there. Actually, a few cuts to make in here. more big chunk. Two more big chunks. Uh, that is a furnace, if I'm not mistaken. There we go. These tethers broke again, so we'll just have to go like boom, boom. Now, what is that? Oh, whoops. I don't know how you got over there. You need to go this way. I'm going to actually nudge the... Uh... Whoops. I was going to say that might nudge that in the proper direction, but it is not, obviously. This is a giant waste of time. Fuck. Fuck. 
That might help. Oh my god. I'm put I'm putting way too much effort into saving these two things. Way too much time. Hopefully that does it. These can be sent too, actually. That's ready to go. These big old chunks ready to be sent out. We'll do that right over there. Watch out! Oh no! And in you go. Okay. Looking good, man. I think now this is actually a fairly easy way to get the containers, too, is just to do it this way. Let's send this one over. Hi -ya. Send this one over. Hi -ya. Oh, hold on. There we go. Oh, that's perfect. You go ahead and in, too. You are ready for action. Hey, it didn't actually get careened into nothingness. Well, I guess the coolant tanks haven't really been doing that as often as the fuel tanks have. This is a bit big. Oh, never mind. I thought it was connected to the other part. That is easy peasy. No sweat. And one more coolant tank. Please don't get flown around. Good. That's such a big chunk. Oh, God damn it. Ah, fuck. That actually did help with that, though, I think, a little bit. So much we're sending off now. This is what you do with fuses. Goodbye. Goodbye now. See? Thumbs up. He even knows. Okay. Same way I deal with all my problems. It's working. It's doing the job, man. You can do that sound all you want. I'm not going to feel like I'm in any danger. And in you go. Cool. Damn fine day so far, I'd say. Fuck. All righty. Always eat your problems into high orbit. That's the bear taffy way. Exactly. This thing is not looking good. This thing has been in better shape. Sounds good, Sol. Yeah, I'll, I'll definitely look back at Hades pretty soon here, I bet. When's the 1.0 update? Is that already out or is that coming out soon? This is ready to go. One point is the next major update in the fall. Okay. I don't even have to disconnect this. I can just send it with the big chunk. And the cargo hatch. There's no reason to disconnect any of that. You just send it all together. That's so much easier. All right, then. Industrial hoist. Oh, hold on. I do have to disconnect this, I guess.
Oh, no, that's the cargo hatch. Hold up. Oh, this is going in the processor, too, though, so I actually just want to cut this off. No, don't do that. And apparently you can't cut the rail guide. Oh, you just cut the four corners of it? Uh, okay. Uh, okay, I understand. I think. Tiny cut points, okay. It's an interesting thing. Still a lot more shells over here. Oh no, wait, this is just the cargo hatch cuts. You just gotta send these like this. Oh, we gotta get the sensor array from there too. I think that's what that is. Oh no, that's just the panel. You got five minutes left in this shift. Knock out that work order before they turn the lights out on you. We wrap. This is all just connected like that. Okay, that's fine. This should work. Let me go ahead and get this one over there too. This will be a lot faster, obviously, just doing that. Such a big piece though, I'm just kind of worried that the furnace is gonna suck it up. That looks okay. I'll just let the rail guide get cut in with that, too. Because that's also being processed. Nice. In you go. In with the rest. I think that's going to work. God damn it, what are you doing? What are you doing? Get... What? No! No! Stop it. Get in there. Get in. Get in. Get in. Get in there. Get in there. Processing valuable Good boy. Credits awarded. And then a little bit more over here. Oops. That's that last one. Attached a wall to a wall. Okay. Another huge chunk right here. There we are. Looking pretty good. Move that down and shoot that in. No sweat, baby. All right, let's get the ECU. And hopefully it's not been totally destroyed. Here we go. One last cut. I think that's free, we're good. So satisfying to get that panel out. And there's the ECU. Which is still connected to the barge because of this last little tube, so hold on. There we go. Yeah, me too, Ross. I love that the music is dynamic. It's so great. Or sorry, Rose. Not Ross. Alright, ECU acquired, man. Let's go. Let's go, crushing it. Good. Give me that heat sink, brother. 
In you go. Oh, that's gonna miss. It's gonna miss. Good. Okay, we got it. Whew. Close. Okay, we got one more little panel up here. Warning. Your oxygen reserves are dropping below statistically profitable levels. That's good. All right, Cutter. Wrap it up. You got about a minute left. Okay, we got more O2 than we got time on the shift, so we just keep going. We might not actually have to do another shift of this. I think we might just be done with this ship. I've gotten most of the valuable stuff. Let's try to get all the door panels. I guess I could get the computer too. Probably not a bad idea. Another atmosphere regulator or two would be good. Oh shit. It's gonna have to do it, I think. Got it! Yeah! I think I got it at the last second. 4.2 million dollars without the reactor is really nice. That's a good day. That is awesome. I bought repair kits. I bought repair kits at the very beginning. I made sure of it. Yeah, we got a few. There we go. We're going to have to buy more, though. All right. Oh, man. Now do all of that and get the reactor on the next ship, right. That's the next goal. All right, man. Four and a half hour stream today, that feels pretty good. I'm satisfied. I think that is gonna wrap it up for me. Thanks for watching everybody, it was a lot of fun today. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you enjoyed some Curse of the Dead Gods in the beginning, a little bit of the hard space ship break in action today. How's the certification looking? That's a good question. Let's take a peek real quick. Oh, we got a ways to go. A little ways to go. We're almost done with the coolant requirement, but still 40 more work order objectives to get, so that'll be that'll be a while. Anyway, yeah, thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed. VOD, of course, over on YouTube.com slash Bear Taffy as well. If you missed any part of it, you can catch it over there. <laughs>